Oh, got go. And that is just part of the fight that ended with a teen and an adult shot after getting off of the JCPS school bus this afternoon. Thanks for joining us, everybody. I'm Lindsay Allen. And I'm Scott Reynolds. WDRB's Katrina Nichols spoke with a neighbor who watched that fight go down. That gunfire is what sent people running in a matter of seconds after several fights broke out on the corner of a bus stop in the Russell neighborhood. Unfortunately, I seen a young man, you know, attempt to, you know, take another innocent person's life over something that could have probably been resolved. Ravante Richardson lives off of 24th and Magazine Streets, where the shooting happened. He was out walking his dog when one adult and an Eastern High School student were shot, according to JCPS. It was pretty, it was pretty hectic, pretty hectic. LMPD says a fight first started on a JCPS school bus. Video sent to WDRB then shows the fighting as it moved onto the street after teens got off the bus. As the fighting shifts to the sidewalk, it intensifies, with some adults trying to break it up. Fists flying, another person has a shoe, one person has a brick, another chases someone with what appears to be a stick or a long piece of wood. That that's when someone pulls out a gun and the video picks up at least three gunshots. You know, nieces, my children, we all live out here. They play out here every day, you know, so for me, it is different. LMPD says both the teen and adults injuries are non life threatening, but hasn't said if it's identified any suspects and its non fatal shooting unit is investigating. It all adds to a growing feeling of frustration of seeing yellow tape hanging in the neighborhood. If it couldn't have been that serious to where you felt like you had a attempt to take someone's life. It's never that serious. In the Russell neighborhood with photojournalist Josh Horton, Katrina Nickel, WDRB News. JCPS said it will have extra security at that bus stop and also at Eastern High School for the rest of this week. There will also be counselors available for students.